We begin with that callous crime in the Bronx. A seven-year-old just trying to buy some fruit when a woman suddenly snatches his cash right from his hand. To make matters worse, when the boy's mother tries to intervene, the woman takes the swing at her and then takes off. And that heartless woman is still on the run. Eyewitness News reporter Janice Yu is live in the Mount Eden section of the Bronx with more. Janice? Phil and Sade, I had a chance to talk to that mom, and she says that she actually has a heart condition and her son has special needs. So this experience was especially traumatic for them. And even today, they are afraid to go outside. Y mi niño temblaba y lloraba. My kid was shivering and, you know, he was just panicking. Julieta Garcia says her seven year old son Mike had just paid for some fruit at Richard's Fruit and Vegetables on Jerome Avenue. He turned around to leave the store with change in hand when a woman snatched it from him. After that, when um, I was going to go in to get the, my, my boy, um, she came out with the money and she pushed me and she punched me in the chest. The woman stormed away with $3, leaving Garcia struggling to breathe and Mike traumatized. She says she's thankful her one-year-old, who was in the stroller at the time, wasn't hurt. Garcia says she's seen this woman in the past, and she had even asked her for money earlier in the day. Eric Vidal's is one of the owners of Richard's Fruit and Vegetables, and he says he was horrified when he saw the video. I just remember about my kids. You know, imagine them going through that. You know, it's really, you know, insane. It's, you get mad at the same time. More than three weeks have passed since this happened, but Garcia and her son are still confused and frightened. No me siento como bien para salir afuera. Me da miedo. I don't feel safe to go out anymore. I'm scared of going out, you know, to buy stuff and everything. And my kid, he's the same. He shivers. He can't sleep alone, so now he's sleeping with me. He gets really scared, too. Well, Garcia says she hopes this woman is caught soon so she doesn't have the chance to do this to anybody else. Now, if you recognize that woman, please take a good look at that picture. And if you do recognize her, please call Crime Stoppers. In, in the Bronx, Janice Hugh, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.